Most pre-meds major in biology, but is this actually the best major to get into medical school? If you want to know what path is right for you, then stick around. Hey everyone, welcome back to AV Med. My name is Adrian and I'm a second year med student at UCSF in San Francisco. And today I'm gonna to talk about the pros and cons of majoring in biology as a pre-med student. You've probably seen graphs like this talking about how non-biology majors actually do better in the med school process, but you also probably have noticed that most pre-med students are majoring in biology. A little bit about my background, at the beginning of undergrad, I wasn't 100% sure I wanted to go to med school, and I didn't know if biology was the right major for me, and I ended up deciding to go to med school, and I majored in molecular and cell bio, and now I am here in med school. But for those of you who are still deciding, I wanted to make this video so maybe I could help you out in making your choice. I'm going to be talking about four pros and four cons of majoring in biology if you want to go to medical school. The first pro of majoring in biology as a pre-med is that it's nice and simple. The vast majority of undergrad biology degrees are going to have all of the pre-med requirements included in the major. So you don't have to think about fulfilling the requirements quite so hard. So that is one benefit of majoring in bio is you don't have to do anything extra. You can just do your major and most likely you're gonna be set for med school. So the first con of majoring in biology is something that I hear a lot, and it's that you're just another pre-med, right? So when you fill out your application, majoring in biology isn't gonna help you stand out because the vast majority of students applying to medical school did major in biology. So that is true that it is gonna make you blend in a little bit more to the crowd, However, I would say that there are many, many ways that you can stand out on your med school app, and it doesn't have to be your undergrad degree. In addition, you can also get a minor if you're worried about standing out based on your study of choice. The next pro of majoring in biology has to do with your BPCM GPA, also called your science GPA. So when you major in biology, you take about two years of lower division courses followed by two years of upper division courses. And any class in biology, physics, chemistry, or math, hence BPCM, is going to be included in a separate GPA in addition to your overall GPA. Because medical schools wanna see how you do in science classes. That's why it's often called your science GPA. And it's very common for the lower division courses to be a lot more challenging in biology majors than the upper division courses. Because the lower division courses are often designed to weed students out, unfortunately, and they tend to be focused on really hard science. While often the upper division courses will be softer sciences and they can still count towards your science GPA. But the upper division courses will often have some easier science courses such as evolutionary biology or some ecology classes, which aren't always an easy A, but it's often easier to do well in those classes than it is in physics. So if you do major in biology, what's really nice is those upper division classes are often easier and you can ace all of those in case you didn't do as well as you wanted in your lower div bio courses. The next con of majoring in biology is that a lot of biology courses are still difficult. Even those upper division courses can still be hard for some people. And many people will choose to major in something such as sociology or some other social science that often aren't as competitive and may be easier to do well in. And for those people, it can be easier to fluff your GPA and take a ton of easy courses in case you had trouble with those lower div classes. However, I would caution you, if you are majoring in something else, Sometimes it can be just as hard as biology. For example, if you're pre-med but you're majoring in bioengineering or computer science, a lot of those classes are quite difficult and it's gonna be hard to inflate your GPA with those classes. So overall, biology can be a pretty challenging major and sometimes if you pick a different major, you can have a higher GPA. The next benefit of majoring in biology is that a lot of upper div biology courses will actually prepare you for medical school. And I can say that from my own experience, there have been several times in med school where I felt like a block was a lot easier or a certain subject was a lot easier 
because I had already taken an upper div bio course in that subject. For example, I took a genetics upper div course in biology and that has really helped me out a couple times in med school. So majoring in biology can be pretty beneficial because those extra courses in bio are gonna make you even better at studying biology topics and give you more core knowledge. I will caution that this is only true if you're taking classes that are relevant to the medical field. So if you're a biology major but you're studying ecosystems and plant life, that's not going to be as applicable as genetics and neuroscience. The next con of majoring in biology is that a lot of pre-med students decide they don't want to go to medical school or maybe they have a hard time getting into medical school and now they've majored in biology and they have to go get a job. And the truth is that unless you're going to medical school or graduate school, biology is not a great degree to get a well-paying job straight out of college. So it can feel like if you're majoring in biology, you don't have a great backup plan unless you go to more schooling because the degree just isn't that valued by employers. So this is definitely something to keep in mind. The final pro of majoring in biology has to do with letters of recommendation. For those of you that don't know, when you apply to medical school, you need a minimum of two letters of recommendation from science professors and one from a non-science professor. And when you major in biology, it can be a lot easier to get good letters of recommendation from upper division professors than from the lower division courses. This depends on your school, but if you went to a large public school like I did, then your lower div science courses probably had hundreds of people in them. And getting the professor to write you a letter of rec and trying to stand out among that group of hundreds can be quite difficult. That's why I chose to get my letters of recommendation from the upper div courses because they were smaller, it was easier to get to know the professor and go to their office hours. So I think that majoring in bio can make it a little bit easier to get those letters of rec. The final con to majoring in biology is that it can be a pretty difficult major, especially if you're coming from an underrepresented background. Most biology departments are not very diverse, and in my case, by the time that I got to the upper div classes at UC Berkeley, I was one of the last Latino kids left who hadn't dropped out of the major yet. So if you feel more comfortable in another department and feel like you're gonna get more support, then you may consider majoring in something else. However, if you are interested in biology, I highly recommend seeking out mentors, especially from your own background, and finding social support that is gonna help you get through your degree. So overall, which pre-meds should major in biology? For one, if you're 100% sure that you wanna to go to medical school or pretty sure, then this may be a good path for you. You may not care as much about having a great backup plan because if you're set on going to medical school and you put all your effort into it, then you may not need one. In addition, if you're someone who really loves biology and is itching to know more about it and learn more about the field, then majoring biology is an obvious choice for you. Finally, if you really want to get into medical school, then majoring in bio is great because you can keep your course load to a minimum and really focus on getting a great GPA. Let's talk about who should not major in biology. For one, if you have a really strong interest in another topic and you're itching to learn about economics or sociology or something else, then it may not be right for you. In addition, if you're not sure at this point if you wanna to go to medical school, then you may wanna major in something more practical so that you have a good career backup. However, I would caution you that when you do major in something else, it can often be like you're doing a double major because you have to take all of the pre-med requirements, which are essentially two full years of classes, in addition to whatever the requirements are for your other major. Finally, you may just be ambitious and want to take other subjects and want to learn more. And if you feel confident that you can do that while maintaining a good enough GPA to get into med school, then you may want to major in something else. So my advice overall is that if you're someone who's unsure what they want to major in, I highly encourage you to explore a lot early on because there's a lot of opportunity at the beginning of college to take different classes, look at different subjects, and really think about what's right for you. If you're thinking about med school, then you should really try to get some shadowing or get involved with pre-med groups to see if this path is right. The sooner you decide if you do want to go to med school, it will make it easier because you'll have more time to work on your application. However, I would say that if you're thinking about going to medical school, then Make sure not to overload yourself with too much. If you take on too many things at the beginning of college, it can really hurt your GPA, and this is gonna be a hard hole to dig yourself out of later. Finally, I would say to not be too influenced by the opinions of others and graphs like the one I showed at the beginning of this video, 
because your major is a highly personal decision and only you can decide what's right. Okay, everyone, those were my thoughts on majoring in biology for pre-meds. Leave a comment down below if you agree, disagree, you wanna add some pros and cons, or maybe you think I was wrong. Feel free to let me know in the comments if you think this was helpful, and I'll see you next time.